Hi everyone, it's Vesper coming to you with what is obviously a rant video about a huge pet peeve of mine. I thought about all kinds of titles for this video, Dear Americans, but then I thought, why am I just targeting Americans even though I see a lot of Americans doing this? It's not just Americans. And I thought maybe I should steer clear of Dear White People because, you know, a title like that is bound to hit some nerves with certain people. But I don't care about that. You know what really, really, really gets to me every single time I see or come across something related to this, it makes me grip my teeth? People's misuse of the term POC, people of color, or person of color, and the various misconceptions that seem to exist about when and how to use this term. I see a lot of people, white people especially, blanketly using this term to refer to anyone who isn't white. And you might be thinking, Vesper, what's wrong with that? So what? You see, the problem is that the world consists of more than just white people and people of color. And now you're probably thinking, Vesper, what the fuck are you talking about? I often see people talking about POC culture in the singular, sometimes in the plural. But let's stop right there for a second. There is no such thing as POC culture, especially not in the singular. And sometimes I even see people talking about POC culture, the POC culture, appropriating from the POC culture. And there is no such thing as the POC culture or appropriating from POC culture, singular. Let's get something straight. POC are hella diverse. We're talking about people with roots from all over the goddamn world. The only thing we have in common is that we're not white, but we're living in a country built on whiteness where white is considered the default and there are institutions in place that fuck us over. Black people, Japanese people, Chinese people, Mexicans, Koreans, everyone living in countries like that, the only thing we have in common is that we're not white. We do not all congregate at your local city hall and have community meetings about the POC community because there is no POC community when speaking generally. Similarly, just as there is no POC community, there is no POC culture, okay? If you're going to talk about people of color in general, then use plurals, plurals. There is no the POC community, POC culture. There are POC communities, there are POC cultures. And this is not me being a grammar Nazi, which is a stupid ass term. This is just you caring and doing right by the people that you were referring to. Also, if you have a specific group of people, specific culture, specific identity in mind when you're talking about something, then say that. Be specific. Do not use the term POC. Too often I see people, even groups or organizations, using the term POC when who or what they're really talking about when the statistics that they're quoting are specifically about black people. If you're talking about black people, then be specific. You can say black Americans, black North Americans, black Brits, black whatever. Just be specific. Don't say POC because when what you're talking about is specific to a group of people, you're forgetting that whatever statistics you're giving, whatever you're saying, does not blanketly apply to people of color. People of color have different situations, different lived experiences, different everything. So don't use statistics or references to a specific group of people to talk blanketly about a much larger group of people. Please stop treating POC as a homogenous group because we're not. We're hella diverse. Recognize that. Okay, so on to the second thing that really, really, really bothers me. And that is sometimes I see people using the term POC cultures and they do use it in a plural, so good job there. But they're saying POC cultures when they're specifically talking about cultures from other countries. Often countries that are very different from their own, like countries in Africa or Asia or South America. Like sometimes they're specifically referring to culture in a specific country like Japan or Korea or China and they refer to that country's culture as a POC culture. Hell, I've even seen people refer to entire countries as POC countries. What the fuck? 
No, seriously, I came across a blog post recently, and this isn't an isolated incident, I've come across this numerous times, that was talking about white guys, white people, living in POC countries. But this post was specifically about white guys living in Asian countries like Japan, China, and Korea. I mean, seriously, you guys might think that I'm making a big deal out of nothing. I mean, what's wrong with this? Why is this so ridiculous and fucking offensive? Well, let me explain that to you, just a second. No, actually, instead of me explaining it to you, please just hop on a plane, fly over here to Japan, and talk to some Japanese people about what it is like being a person of color. No, seriously, I want you to come over here and ask them what it's like being POC so that you can see the reaction on their face in person when they look at you like, what the fuck American or whatever it is that you are, because... The question that you're asking them makes no fucking sense. And then after you fly over here to Japan, hop on another flight over to India and over to Ghana and then over to Peru and ask all these people, what is it like being a person of color? And I guarantee you that the reaction is going to be the same. What the fuck is wrong with you, you white person? See, the world does not just comprise of white people and then everyone else that you can conveniently lump together as people of color. No. Japanese people are Japanese, Peruvians are Peruvian, Brazilians are Brazilians, etc, etc. And Africa, by the way, is not a fucking country, it is a continent comprised of 54 fucking countries. It is just as diverse, if not more so, than Europe. But, okay, I'm, I'm going off topic here. POC is a term born out of colonialism, specifically U.S. colonial history. It cannot be used outside of this context. It refers specifically to the experiences of people who are not white, living in countries built on whiteness. It is not a term that can be used to describe the world outside of your country or the world at large, because the world at large does not exist or revolve around your country's history with colonialism and racialization. Which is why a Japanese American would probably self-identify as POC, but a Japanese person born and raised in Japan that has nothing to do with America and Canada and all that stuff will probably not self-identify as POC because POC means nothing in countries that are not built on whiteness. So by all means, please do use the term POC, POC communities, POC cultures, when it is what you are actually talking about. But please do not use POC blanketly to refer to all people who are not white, because in doing so, in blanketly using POC all the time indiscriminately, you are essentially treating white as the default and then throwing everyone else into this huge category of non-whiteness that you refer to as POC. And that is just not correct. It's hella offensive. Don't do it. Put some thought into what you are actually saying before you jump to the term that is also convenient in Western society. And really, that's all this video is about. I know I may have said something to offend you or to offend people, whatever. I would say I'm sorry, but I'm not. You can think what you want of my opinion in this video, but I'm really just trying to help people be more accurate and less offensive when they talk about people who are not white. That is all this video is about. And thank you for watching. If you watch this whole video, you are amazing. And I'll see you next time. Bye.